Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. So since many of you commented me and asked me how we can use YouTube and watch it on your older devices running iOS 10 or iOS 9. As you know that the official YouTube app isn't working and yes the fix which worked with the jailbreak is not working or if it works the elements are not properly displayed so this video is not a fix it is a work around to make your old devices usable which maybe are lying in your drawer collecting dust yes with this workaround you will be able to open youtube right from your home screen and yes it works without a jailbreak and it even works on any device for example ios 12 or higher on which YouTube is not working. Now to reduce your confusion, I will simply remove the YouTube app. Now the workaround is very simple. You will simply open Safari and simply head to the official YouTube website. All right, all right. Once it fully loads, simply hit this share button and then simply add to home screen. You will see this option. All right. Now in the name, you can simply remove home and leave YouTube here. Then hit add. You can see YouTube is now being shown in home screen. Now if you open Safari and remove this tab, whenever you will open YouTube from your home screen, it will load. And everything works from signing in to your account to liking the video just like the native youtube app for example i will search for my channel you can see it works fine without any problem here and when you hit you right here you will be able to sign in and as an example you can see this screenshot here i am successfully signed in and everything works once your watch history is populated you will see the thumbnails like you do in the YouTube app just fine. Now the same process can be done on your iOS 9 devices. As you can see the version here, you will simply head to Safari, open youtube.com here, then hit this share button and on iOS 9 you will see the same option to add to home screen. Once done, you will see YouTube on your home screen and you can open it. As you can see it right here on your screen. And of course, you will be able to sign in to your account without any issues. Yes, this method will work on any device running iOS 12 or higher even because this workaround will always work. That's all for this video. If you still have questions, please ask in the comment section and I will reply you as soon as possible. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care.